Okay, this is the Purple and Teal's Dutch Pour that I did in my video number five. It's now on my website, and um, it has been sealed with uh, two coats of top coat. I'm going to bring it in just so you can see how pretty it is. With the shimmer and shine. interested again it's on my website hi everybody it's Christy with Christy Cole artistry and tonight I'm going to be working on a 16 by 20 black canvas with a black background I haven't done one of those on video yet so we're going to try something interesting I'm wearing a very colorful shirt this evening and I am going to be using 11 colors in our painting so we're either going to end up with something beautiful or it could be just a money mess, but let's try it and find out. So I'm gonna flood the canvas and I'll be right back. Hey everybody, I'm back. I've flooded the canvas and now I'm gonna pop the bubbles. Seems to be a lot of bubbles in here tonight. Okay, let's look at tonight's colors. Tonight, we are going to be using Liquitex Basic Prussian Blue, Deco Art Extreme Sheen Deep Sapphire, Master Touch Sky Blue, Master Touch Lake Blue, My trusty Liquitex Basic Aqua. Extreme Sheen Sterling Silver. I'm going to throw in some Ready Pour Lime Green. Actually, it's Chartreuse Lime Green. Um, and then we're going to go to Deco Art Extreme Sheen Rose Quartz. Liquitex Basics Rose Pink. Deco Art Extreme Sheen Pink Tourmaline. And lastly, Artist Lock Brilliant Magenta. So like I said, there's a lot of colors, but I want to try this, so we're going to go ahead. All right, um, the design that I've chosen for this is going to be a little odd. I am going to do um, the uh, blues on this side, the pinks and magentas on this side, and then I'm going to use the um, aqua, the sterling silver, and the lime green in both. And we'll see what happens. So let's start here. And like I said, we're just going to go on the side here. Just like that. It's probably hard to see because it's really dark. But let's see what happens. Goodness, brand new bottles. I heard it get open. Alright, this is a extreme sheen. Over that way on that one. Oh well. And sky blue. A lot of these are paints I just purchased, so kind of wanted to play with them tonight. And this is the lake blue. Oh my goodness. Stuck. Okay. Well, that's pretty too. Those are some pretty blues. Okay, and then like I said, I'm going to use the aqua. Oops. Aqua. The silver now. And this, I've not tried the sil sterling silver yet, so we'll see what Extreme Sheen does when we get it in here. And then the lime. I know it's an odd color, but I had some leftover and I decided, you know what, I'm going to try it in here and see what happens. If I like it, I'll go get some more. If not, it'll be done. Okay, next we are going to do, let's see which one's darker. Brilliant Magenta. So we're going to do Brilliant Magenta this way. 
And since I went over in that one, I'm going to do the same thing over there. Then Extreme Sheen Pink Tourmaline. Then Rose Pink. I love these colors. I just hope they blow out really nice. Because the colors on the black are really nice so far. So hopefully they stay that way. This was our um, Extreme Sheen Rose Pink. And then, like I said, I'm going to do the lime green. First, I'm going to do the aqua. I think it needs a little touch of green. And then the sterling, and then the, and then the um, lime green. Sterling, and now the lime green. I don't know. They look pretty interesting. Let's see what happens. Like it the way it is. Should we just leave it? No, we can't leave it. Okay, let's blow it out. And I think I don't want it so sharp, so I'm going to take this off. Okay, and we're going to go on high, and we're going to blow from side to side, and then up and around. it um it really looks neat um needs a little more color over here but the the blue the lime green actually looks really cool um i know you can't see it very well i'm going to bring you down but there's cells popping from all the the um, extreme sheens and stuff and these will um the extreme sheens will shine glossy but the lime green and the pink and the lime green and i think it says lake blue in this Sky blue, I just bought these. Really make the green pop. I thought it was gonna turn out ugly. This is beautiful. All right, um, let me fix my sides and I will um, bring you down so that you have a close up on it. Be just a minute. Okay, everybody, here it is. Is this not the weirdest picture you've ever seen? But it's so cool. So I'm gonna take you in closer so that you can see it. I'm sorry about the reflecting of my, my lights, but um, let me take you in and show you the lime green and how beautiful it actually looks. So here we go. So look at the lime green. It's so pretty in there. And the cells, oh my goodness, look at the cells. They're just popping through everything. We've got some really interesting squiggles going on. I really like this painting. And I thought, you know what, with all those colors, it's going to come out weird. But you know what? This is beautiful. All right, so let's go on to the pink side. This is really cool. Look at, look at the way the turquoise and the green blended in with all those pinks and magentas. It's so pretty. And then it did the same thing over here. It just made tons of cells. Look at that. It's so cool. I'm really happy with this painting. I was really nervous because I thought, you know, 11 colors is a lot of color, but it came out so cool. And when I coat this um, with varnish or a top coat, I haven't decided which yet, it is gonna be really pretty. So I'm gonna try to get you up here so that you can see the whole painting. Isn't that pretty? So this is going to dry for a couple days, and then I'm going to put the uh, sealer on it. And then once it's sealed, I'll put it up on my website. And all of my information on my website and my email will be at the end of this video. But I wanted to show you, I mean, this is, this is all my colors I chose to use. It's a lot of colors. But you know what? I think I'll do it again. So I know I'll use the pink, the aqua, and the lime green again. So I guess I'm going to have to go buy some more lime green. But yeah, I used all those colors. So if you like this uh, painting, just let me know. Um, I've been trying to reply to comments, 
but since my website is so new, I apologize, I'm not sure how to do it. I tried to, to send thank yous to um, some of you that have commented, and I'm still trying to figure it out, so I didn't forget you. I really appreciate it um, for liking and subscribing, and the comments have been wonderful, so thank you very much. Appreciate it. All right. You have a great evening, morning, afternoon, whatever it is where you are, and uh, take care. Bye.